the lady was like, it can take up to six months before we even get a decision on if you will or will not be approved for approved or not approved for your unemployment when i was sitting right there in that woman's office god said in 30 days you will get your on your first unemployment check in 30 days let me tell you something god is never late never late 30 days from the day i was sitting in that woman's office i got my first unemployment deposit with all of the back pay that they owed me from the day that I went into that unemployment office. But see what happened was I, God had to make me uncomfortable because in comfort you cannot grow. In comfort you will not reach your destiny. In comfort you will not do what God has placed you on this earth to do. So you may be right now losing friends. People that you thought were your A1s since day one have turned their back on you. Family has lied on you and pushed you away. P business decisions and things may have fallen to the wayside your money may have gotten funny and baby your change may be a little bit strange and credit just won't get it but let me tell you about the God that we serve God will make you uncomfortable so that it will push you into your destiny see as long as you were comfortable and you were getting a little bit of money that you were getting when you had people patting you on your back encouraging you but they really weren't encouraging you to, to reach your destiny they were encouraging you to stay in that place of mediocrity and see God wants you to walk and live a life abundantly every day of your life but because you were comfortable you could not achieve it so that's why right now things are going haywire in your life because God says I'm trying to catapult you not walk you to but I'm trying to catapult you into your destiny you've been in that place where I have no longer ordained for you to be for too long you've been in a dry place for too long now I'm allowing everything around you to become uncomfortable so that you can get what I've been trying to give you for the last seven years I hear God say the last seven years I've been trying to get you to your destiny but you have allowed fear you have allowed comfort you have allowed naysayers to keep you stagnant and I've been trying to push you into your land of greater that's why you're uncomfortable see God has to allow you to get uncomfortable to get you where he's trying to get you to you hanging around people that don't even believe what you believe they don't even believe in prosperity. They don't even believe in abundance. They have a poverty mentality, a slavery mentality, and you're connected to them and you're wondering why you have not reached your level of overflow. Why you are not walking now into the land of milk and honey. God says because what you are connected to has hindered you. I posted that status yesterday. What we're connected to will determine what we give birth to. So if you're connected, if you're lying in your connection and your circle, it's poverty, slavery mentality, doesn't believe in, in the blessings and the abundance of God, then that's why you have yet to produce that million dollar business that is on the inside of you. You allow your comfort zone. You allowed your comfort zone to keep you stagnant. So God says, since you wouldn't walk into it willingly, I had to make you uncomfortable. See, everything God does is strategic. Everything he does is intentional. So that is why you're in that place of uncomfortable because when you're uncomfortable, you're going to make a move. Ladies, we can attest to this. When we put those heels on, they may look good for, to us. You know what I'm saying? They may look good to us, but oh, when they start squeezing on that baby toe, that pinky toe, and we start walking like a pigeon, we're going to take the shoe off. I know I do. I, keep, I will walk barefoot if I have to. And for my men, you know, you got this suit on and it's a little, little bit tight around that midsection and you about to pop. Oh, you gonna unsnap that button. You gonna unsnap it. Either you gonna unsnap it or it's gonna pop off. One of the two. But it's coming off and you're coming out. And that's what God wanted me to tell you today that you're getting ready, to, you're coming out. He's, he's catapulting you into your destiny. That's why everything around you has made you uncomfortable. You don't feel the same when you have uh, certain conversations anymore. Certain things that you used to be comfortable doing, now they irritate you. God said, I had to make you uncomfortable so that you could be catapulted into your destiny.